Okay, so today we're gonna be doing the one palette challenge on my eyes. So I'm gonna be using the Anastasia Beverly Hills Prism Palette on my eyes. So basically, these are all the colors that I have to manage to put on my eye. And I have to incorporate all of these colors. 14 shades on my eyes today. Um, I don't know how I'm gonna do this, but I'm gonna make it work with these colors. You see, some of these colors don't flow necessarily. So I'm gonna have to, you know, finesse it a little bit. But yeah, I'll be taking these colors on my eye. And if you wanna see the final look, stay tuned and watch the video. So I'm using Medium Dark 32 in ColourPop, the No Filter Concealer on my eyes. And that's just gonna be the base for all the eyeshadow. So I'm just gonna do a thin layer all over. So oh, in this palette, I'm going to start off with, I gotta use all 14 shades, okay? So I'm gonna start with Unity, and that's just gonna be an all over color. So now, we gonna do this is gonna get a little tricky so i'm gonna mix lure and eden and that's gonna be my two transition shades okay guys oh that's pretty okay, i'm gonna take saturn this color right here the inner portion of the transition area so, so far I've used one two three four colors ten more colors to use so next I'm going to cut my lid So I'm just going to cut it out if you want to get a little crazy. So I'm going to take Eternal and I'm going to put that sort of, sort of not on the outer part but a little bit inwards that eternal color because it's about to be a bunch of colors on here we're gonna get an eye look in pyramid is like that golden color and I'm gonna put that right next to eternal so sphinx is that darker coppery color I'm going to take sphinx and put that right next to to eternal like right there it kind of all looks like one color but it's not it's three separate colors team with purple and blue reflex in it and I'm gonna mix that with Osiris and I'm gonna put that on the outer edge a NYX eyeshadow base in this base okay so I'm gonna go in my crease area I'm gonna do two colors I'm gonna mix I'm gonna do lucid and dimension so lucid is this white color with some sparkle in it I'm gonna take that color put it on the beginning part. then I'm gonna take dimension which is this purplish 
lilac color and I'm gonna put that on the rest of it it's not really picking it up but it's like super light on camera oh okay so I only have Obsidian, Obsidian and that green left so that lime green so what I'm gonna do super easy I'm going to put the green right here and then I'm going to put loose it in the inner corner and then smoke out the bottom so I'm putting some white down just so that green can pop I'm gonna take spear which is this bright green color this bright green color it's like a lime green highlighter green I'm gonna take that and put it on top of that white base I'm back into Eternal and Pyramid just to blend that into the green. Okay, so I don't think this looks that bad. Would I necessarily wear this out on a date? No, ma'am. Ham, turkey, and cheese. I would not, but I'm going to take that white color, Lucid, which is this color right here. Put it in the inner corner. I'm going to take my Evian spray. Just go on line. Do it as liner. Is the eye using all 14 shades? So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to come back with the other eye finished, um, lashes, mascara, and a lip, and I'll be right back. This concludes the one palette makeup challenge I used on my eyes. And I used the Anastasia Beverly Hills Prism Palette. I used all 14 shades. Now, I did notice that I actually forgot to put parallel on camera, and that was the brown color. So what I did was on my bottom lash line, I just smoked it out um, because I honestly forgot to use that brown color. But besides that color, I um, used all the other colors in the palette. It was kind of tricky, but we got through it. If you would like to see any more One Palette makeup challenge tutorials, let me know. I have mad palettes I can use. So yeah, this one was fun. It really pushed me out of my comfort zone too. So thank you for watching my video and stay tuned for more. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Bye. So if you see me. Bruh. So it's gonna look something like that. That's pretty. So, so I think I'm gonna regret this. Same with my cool kids next time.